Hello and welcome, my name is Parky and today we're playing some more SimCity 5, The Cities of Tomorrow. Now, today we've got quite a few things I want to be doing. Last time we left off we set up the HQ of a Megaco. We also finished off this single Mega Tower here, which is pretty damn cool indeed. Now a few things have changed between this and the last episode. For some reason, I think it might just be due to the fact that there's some really fucking massive things on the screen with like lots of shiny lights, but when I loaded the game up today, and it might just be me turning on the computer today and it being a bit derp, the map is lagging slightly, and I don't know whether that's due to the connection to the servers or what, but I've had to turn down the settings temporarily so we can carry on. Now one thing I wanted to do today was basically to replace this uh, broken nano center place that we got quite a while ago, because it's bothering me that it's broken. Now actually, are we researching anything? We are actually. Maybe I should wait until that research is done, because I don't want it to reset or anything else, that'd be stupid. Okay, and aside from that, actually, when do we get to... When do we get to build our next one? Oh, I assume on the Academy 3 upgrade. Yeah, that would make a lot of sense, wouldn't it? Right, now this one, uh, we're basically almost, almost there to the uh, franchise hourly profits that we needed to get the next upgrade, which is exactly what we want. And as I said last time, we are going to be starting to build the Elite Mega Tower, <laughs> which is incredibly exciting! because I've actually almost got enough money for it as well, which is wonderful. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to put it in this area here, because there's a couple of band buildings here anywhere, and to be honest, whatever. Whatever indeed. So we, actually, no, maybe I should put it like here, I don't know. Either way, I really want one of those. <laughs> so let's figure out how big it is first, uh, by going into here, like so. So we want an elite one, which is a nice shiny modern one. Right, okay, so elite mega tower with apartment level. I think this is probably what we want. Now, actually, this doesn't look too big. I mean, we could probably put it over here, actually, to be honest, which is absolutely fine of me indeed. I'm sorry the game is a bit laggy. I have noticed this. Um, I'm going to try and figure this out for next episode. Um, let's see if we can... Oh, God. Everything's get getting in the way. All the buildings are too big. Okay, so we're going to get rid of all this stuff here. You see what I mean by the frame rate, though? I mean, it, there's nothing I can do about it. It's just really weird. I don't understand why it's happening. But uh, we're going to have to deal with it. Oh, god damn! I keep breaking the bloody road things for... Not the road things. What are they called? The stupid maglev tracks. Right, so let's get rid of this. We're going to reconnect the maglev because I'm an idiot. And we're going to place down this. And this is going to go like... So, yes, there we go, wonderful. Let's just slow this down a little bit, maybe it'll stop lagging. I don't know whether you're even going to be able to see it in the video, I apologise for keep mentioning it if you can't. But, yeah, I really need to sort that out. It, I don't normally get these sort of problems with my computer, it's very odd. However, we're going to ignore it for now, because whatever, and it is boring. Right, so there's the Mega Tower, the Elite Mega Tower going down. We currently have no money again, which is fine. Now... I'm not too concerned about power anymore, because that other thing has given us an excess. Now, you know, the peak of the other mega tower that we built up here. Where is it? I can't even bloody see it. The tower's so big. The solar power thing at the top of this has now given us an excess of 260 megawatts, which is pretty, uh, pretty crazy, if I'm honest. So what we want to do is we want to connect these roads up again, because, as we learned from last time, it helps to have roads connected to your mega tower. So I think, okay, I think we need to put one in here. We're going to do it like so. And then I think, is there one this side? No, there isn't. Which means I think actually we. I th Stop saying I think! God damn it! Okay, right, so we're going to put a road here. Reconnect this up because everyone's getting angry. And then round the back, this must be where the other bit of road is. Yeah, look, there we go. Okay, so then we're going to put this along here like. So, and like so. Right, and then that shall allow us to build some more residential here. Not that we really need to worry about this due to the amount of people that you actually get in these mega towers. So we're going to have another surge of population very soon, which is something I would normally worry about. I'm going to start worrying about the sewage, perhaps, a little bit, and maybe the water supply. But in the meantime, there's not much we can do about it. God, this frame rate, it's certainly not helping. I'm destroying all these buildings. Okay, 
So we're going to get rid of all of this, because these are all completely useless now. And to be honest, I'm not even too concerned about using space up with other buildings. I'm actually quite looking forward to placing down the Academy expansion, the next uh, one that you can buy. Which is going to be pretty damn cool. I think. No, this is not quite done yet. Let's have a little look at this. Maybe we can start doing a bit more over here. Let's have a look. Mega production line. Yeah, we could do that. Drone assembly line. Oh, that'd be so cool. I really, I really want that. <laughs> okay, and then aside from that, actually, maybe I was thinking we should just increase the amount of stuff we're importing. I think that would probably be a good idea. So let's see. We want to import. I think to do this, we actually need to expand the depot over here, which is absolutely fine because we have enough money to. Oh, and actually, no, you can only put one of each, so no, I can't. As a complete lie, we can put a freight truck thing here, though, which might increase the speed at which they start delivering things. In fact, let's just do that now anyway, because who cares? Okay, so, aside from that, I think everything is fine and dandy. We've got eight abandoned... We've got eight rubble buildings, actually. Rubble buildings? No, they're actually abandoned. There we go. Get rid of these. I can't even see the other ones. My eyesight is awful. Okay, there's one up here... And everything seems fine. Got the hydro power. I don't think power's ever going to be an issue, really, for us. We're going to need some... Yeah, this is what I thought was going to happen. We need control net, which is what we're currently working towards. This was the issue, wasn't it? Okay, but we don't need to worry, because this is almost done. As soon as control net is up again, this should be fine. Should. And in terms of water, we probably could do some more backup water things anyway. It's because, I mean, you don't actually lose anything from putting them down, I suppose, aside from the groundwater that you place, or lose, but, you know, whatever. So we're going to put down a few of these, just as a little backup thing, because you know, you know what I'm like, I have OCD, I must have backups of everything. So, this is going to go here, like so, and we should have enough water. So water is not a problem. Sewage, on the other hand, is. Now, there's not much we can do about that either. Oh, do these use control net as well? No, they don't. I was going to say, what the hell? Water is fine, but it's still giving me the error message, which is weird. And we need control net for this. Basically, now we're just having a big spaz over control net. And look at that, we've got 50,000 now. Time to think about the future. This city is starting to get big and there's only so much space. What happens when there's not enough people there for there? We need to consider working towards an arcology. Blah. Okay, yeah, so that's the big uh, building that you work towards, which is absolutely fine. We'll deal with that later on, because I really can't be bothered. Oh, there's actually an upgrade available here. Here we go. And we're going to expand. There we go. And I think now that means we can place down one of these things. And I think if I'm going to go for one, I'm honestly going to go for... Let's put a sign on there. Why don't we put a sign? And we'll go for Department of... thing is, we don't need that because we've got all the modern versions. Tourism would be good. I think that's the only other one which is like moderately useful. So yeah, let's do that. We'll put that there like that as well. Because why not? Why not indeed? Oh, we can put another one down. Okay. Uh, let's go for finance. Yeah. Wonderful. Obviously forgot to do that last time, or I just didn't decide which one I wanted. I can't even remember. Okay, now this is not getting any closer, which is fine. Oh wow, look at that! Epic! Oh, it makes the other mag the other mega tower look like shit. So let's see what levels are on this one. I'm assuming apartment level... So that's a medium apartment level. Okay. Probably want... What other services have we got? Education level? Okay, let's go for... Let's go for a high... Yeah, let's, let's go for a very expensive apartment level. That sounds like a good idea. You know, expand the population even more so I struggle to cope with them. Perfect! <laughs> you know? What am I doing with my life? Okay, right, so we're going to need to expand the hospital, obviously, because we've got so many people here now, we can't even deal with them. So we're going to put one of these here. We're also going to put another one of these, like so, and then start expanding the... Uh, what are these called? Ambulance bays. Yes! I know I just destroyed an entire apartment block for an ambulance bay, but it's fine. Lots of health issues. Well, hopefully not too soon. There we go. We should have plenty of health coverage. Everything else seems fine. Two crimes. I mean, we could expand the uh, police station, but to be honest, they seem to be doing alright. 
I'm not too concerned. This looks really cool. Is it going to be like a really thin tower? Oh, so cool. I mean, when you compare it to the look of this one, you have to admit, that does look incredibly good. Okay. Right, and, and the other good thing is it will give us the high wealth workers, which means that we'll start researching things even quicker, which is exactly what we want. As soon as it's done researching, I'm going to replace that, because it really bothers me that it's destroyed. And then aside from that, really, how's this garbage doing? It's fine. I mean, our income is still steady at about 10,000. Uh, the population is going to probably surge in a second, which again is, oh god, is actually fine as well. Okay, so now we've got medium and high level uh, apartments. So we probably want a mall level. I think that sounds like a good idea. High wealth mall level. Because obviously this whole side of the city is high wealth. And including this, arguably. So we've got more high wealth than we do low. Which is probably why we want to focus on that a bit more. Okay, now what is this? They're going to ask me to put down more par parking par bays. Car park! Car parking! Sorry, why would you even watch these videos? Okay, so we're going to put these down, and then uh, I think that's fine. Yeah, that seems to shut them up. Wonderful. Okay, and a mayor's mansion, which I think we're probably going to put somewhere which isn't particularly good placement, but it's fine. Maybe we can put it up here somewhere? Yeah, let's put it down here. There you go, and that'll make everyone a lot happier. That nice surge, that wave going across the city. I have to admit, I really do like this city. I mean, people complain to me about how I laid out the grid system. Like, I did it on purpose. <laughs> like, come on now. Come on. High tech. Just keep this speed up so we can gain some more money. Now, what does this do? Uh, they can earn money to pay rent. Okay, services. We could probably do with an education level. That might be good. Park level would be good as well, because that will raise a higher wealth land value. And to be honest, I kind of want to see it anyway, because it looks pretty damn cool. Okay, so we're making the uh, high wealth areas very happy, because obviously we're going to look after our main wealth earners, which is absolutely fine. Right, there we go. Control net. <laughs> I think I just had a fit. Okay, so this is what we want. And we're going to put it down here. Ah, oh, finally. So once this is hiring, we can then start having all of our services working properly, which is going to be absolutely fantastic. Uh, we do not really want to sell this to neighbours. We're just going to use it all ourselves, like greedy people. Okay, so there we are. So we should be transmitting enough now, hopefully to keep this running. Let's see, actually, can we... Did we close some of these down? Oh no, they're all working. Maybe we should just put down another one anyway. That seems like a good idea. Okay, right, so there we go. The control net's working. This is still struggling, actually. I might have to put another... Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Okay, and as I said, I'm going to replace this because it's really bothering me. Can we just... No, okay, we can't, we can't bloody do it. So let's just get rid of this. What was this again? The nanoscale engineering. Okay, so we're going to put down this here again. Because it got trampled by Godzilla. Which is not anything I expected to say, really. And there we go. Right. Wonderful. So now that's done, that looks a hell of a lot better. And we can start researching... Oh, Skybridge would be cool. Fusion nuclear air scrubbing. Let's go with level 3. Let's just do it, shall we? This is probably going to take absolutely ages. Probably a good idea for me to start it now, though. Okay, and this is done. That park level looks pretty damn cool. Actually, let's just check. Has it kept... I would have assumed it was high wealth around here anyway. Yeah, and if you look, it's it exactly what I set out in the first place, which is absolutely fine. And then what we're going to do is we are going to add another layer on. Right, so we got... Apartment level high wealth, mall level high wealth, park level, probably want education level. To be honest, I want to save a few levels on this to start putting down things like the Skybridge level and other things, because I think that'd be pretty damn cool. And then after this one, we're going to start up another low wealth one of these, and we're going to have a high tech office when we can afford it, which is not yet. 
but that's fine. It's something to aim for. So there we go. That does look really cool. Looks like the Shard in the way in, in London, the big pointy building. Okay, so Megaco cannot progress this far yet. I'm thinking we're just going to bung this down for now just because, well, we're not going to lose anything from it. We're going to gain production and then as soon as we don't need this anymore, we can delete one of them and replace it with one of these other things that we want. So there we go. Just so that we can get to that next level of Omega Co, that would be very helpful indeed. So I think that should just tip us over the edge now. We'll have to see. I mean, it's probably going to take a little while for that to start pumping it out, but that's absolutely fine of me. And to be honest, do we have, like, car park things that we can... No. Okay, what the hell is that? It's like extraction pod pipeline. Okay. Sure. <laughs> I don't even know what that is, but that's fine. Right. Community college... Yeah, I don't really like doing that, that's fine. We're going to leave the community college. Yeah, that's going to take ages, but, you know, as I said, it doesn't matter too much. The one good thing about having this elite mega tower over here is that it's obviously boosted up our high wealth working supply, which means that we're going to have, hopefully, a pretty quick supply for the academy to start researching things that we want. At least I say that with the uh, sort of vague hope that that's what it's actually going to do. Right, okay, so in terms of this, we need... Lots of health issues. You're telling me, bloody hell. Let's put down another one of these. We're going to need it. Can't actually put down another one of these because I've been an idiot and laid this out in a really stupid way. But it's fine. Maybe we should actually... Look, there's a train track here. Why don't we put down a train station? Maglev station closed. Control net needed. Ah. Okay, well, there's nothing wrong with having... Oh, no, because we didn't... <laughs> put down the Department of Transportation like an idiot. I am a genuine idiot sometimes, aren't I? Oh, I can build a university. That'd be pretty cool. Streetcars as well. I mean, do we really need those? Probably not. High traffic congestion. You know, we're going to do it. We're going to put down this here. And we're going to start putting down some of these things because I'm thinking it's about time we had some... You know, it's not very futuristic buses, but, you know, it's going to help. So... <laughs> I feel a bit cheap doing this. I wanted it all to be like nice and high tech, but no, I suppose you are going to have buses in the future as well, so you can't complain. So there we go, we're going to put this here. Luckily we've got nice big roads which are sort of feeding supply of this to everywhere else. I think that's pretty good coverage, if I do say so myself, with quite few uh, stops, which is quite optimal, if I do say so myself. Okay, we'll put a park and ride there so people actually start using the bus stops. Right, and then aside from that, I think we're okay. Let's just speed this up a little bit. Okay, now let's put down the university, because university is cool. Where it's not, it's bloody rubbish, because I go myself, but you know. You know what I'm trying to say. To be honest, I think that's probably a good place to end it. I'm just going to get rid of a few of these uh, other rubbish buildings, so they can be replaced. No shoppers, probably because all these shoppers are going to the new mega towers. So they've got bigger and better shops than you'll ever have. Sorry. Right, okay, well this seems like a good place to end it. If you enjoyed the episode, even though it's been a bit, hopefully not too frame rate issue -y, then please leave your support in the comment section below. I'm going to fix it, all the errors I've got anyway, my end, next time. Oh, I've got Arcology we've unlocked. Right, okay, so, if you enjoyed the episode, please feel free to leave your support in the comment section below. Also feel free to leave some support in terms of likes and ratings, because that particularly helps the series and my channel. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Awkward. Awkward goodbye. Awkward. Why was this flashing? Ooh. Goodbye!